And that's what I call pretty fair puck control for 10, 11, 12, and one 13-year-old. Hey, come in here, fellas. Hurry up. Stand up there. One, two, three, four. Look. What comes next in puck control is absolutely useless, at least it is in my opinion, unless the sticks are this length. The first thing you have to have for good puck control is a stick the proper length. Look, below the chin, not at the chin or above the chin. Puck control, stay with us. Anybody can master it. All right, we're going to talk puck control. It's a skill, hussy, that anybody can master. Anybody, anywhere, anytime, if they work at it. And you got a coach who's willing to teach it and insist on the key points. No problem. Look at fellas, grip is most important. Now just watch, look at. See the top hand on the stick? And right on the end of the stick. None of those great big cotton picking knobs that you see some of the pros use. Just a nice form-fitting knob and squeeze it right on the end of the stick. And a buddy of mine used to say, squeeze that stick till the sawdust comes out of it. And if you do that, you'll never drop it, will you, Beckett? No way. That's right. Look at the V in the, in the top hand and the stick goes to the right shoulder if you're a right-handed shot like I am. Now, the next one is the bottom hand. And the same thing. Look, right over top the stick. Watch. That's it, Cruz. Watch. Not on the side. Right over top. And look at the elbow is the key. You don't bend the elbow. Elbow has to be straight. And I'll show you why in a minute. It forces you into the right position, but the key to puck control... Come on, Taylor, keep your head up and listen. You couldn't carry a football. You might learn something. Look at it. Hey, the key to puck control is the ability to be able to roll the wrist. Right grip, right hands a proper distance apart in the stick handling position. Not in the shooting position, in the stick handling position. Now, when I move the puck, watch my wrists. Ah, Beckett. Wrist, not puck. Watch the wrist. See how the wrist roll back and forth? You roll the wrist, not the stick inside the palm of your hand. You roll the wrist. Now watch the stick. Watch the stick. When you roll, you take the puck to the left, the heel comes out, see? And the toe comes in and the puck stays in the middle. Now watch what happens when I go here. I roll the wrist, the heel goes out, the toe comes in, and look at fellas, the puck has to stay in the stick handling position. Hey, look, has to stay in the middle of the stick. The key again to puck control is keeping the full blade of the stick on the ice and the puck at or near the center of the stick and rolling the wrist. Look, see, no matter what I do, I couldn't lose the puck if I wanted to and carrying out in front of me as long as I roll the wrist and then practice it this way. Look at one hand on the stick and roll it. Top hand, see, back and forth. 